Jesus Freak, you belong to me, and this is the goddamn punk rock version. Hey everyone, I want to talk to you about the Bible. Yeah, too bad nobody gives a fuck. But few people would actually argue that the Bible is a scientific book. You're right, we call those people morons. You see, people don't realize that the Bible has offered some of the greatest scientific knowledge that we have today. Of course, talking snakes, pregnant virgins, yeah, definitely. Doesn't the Bible teach that the earth is flat and has four corners? Maybe not, but it definitely says something about a guy rising from the dead, and we know that that doesn't really happen, don't we? The Bible was so far ahead of its time. <laughs> Another good bit of scientific information is that the book of Job 38.16 actually mentions Ocean Springs. That's fascinating. Did the book of Job happen to mention how it was possible scientifically for a man to turn water into wine? I think when we look at the Bible, sometimes we decide to view it as all oh, merely historical content. Well, I kind of look at it like Alice in Wonderland. But really, there's so much information that we can read and study. Yeah, there's a lot of information in the goddamn pokey little puppy that I could read and study too, but what fucking good would it do me? And actually bolster our faith. Which is really the whole goddamn point of scripture to begin with, isn't it? The Bible does not contradict science. Right, of course not, and men walk on water all the time, don't they? Then shut the fuck up. <laughs>